So ladies and gentlemen, here's another video comparison between two MacBooks. This time we have MacBook Pro 2014 with a quad-core i7, 16 gigs of RAM, 256 solid-state drive and 2013 MacBook Air uh, with i7, a dual-core i7 processor at 1.7 gigahertz and 8 gigs of RAM with 256 gigs of, gigs of solid state drive what we're doing is we're gonna export the video file out of iMovie with the best settings it's exactly the same file it's a, it's a 5 minute video at 1080p 60 frames per second and we're gonna export the best setting um, out of the iMovie doing an encoding and we'll see who's gonna win is it really um, these two guys are about Several eight, seven, seven or eight hundred dollars apart at the price range. Um, the MacBook Pro is about seven hundred dollars more than this guy, and we'll see what the difference is. Is it really worth of spending that extra money, or can we just stay with the thirteen, fourteen hundred dollars MacBook Air and it's we're only shaving off a couple of minutes? And so let's get this going, and we'll see who's gonna who's gonna do what. There you go, and let's start it. And so far, this is what we have: the MacBook Pro Quad Core i7 is telling me that it's gonna take two minutes to edit this video. Um, MacBook Air i7 processor, the dual core. Um, is telling me that it's gonna take four minutes to do the video so two minutes versus four minutes and eight hundred dollars apart um, we're gonna wait it's only a couple of minutes but it's really interesting how how compatible this MacBook Air is so we'll give it a minute or so let this um, guy finish this um, exporting and then we're gonna wait for MacBook Air to finish its exporting to really confirm that this is really it says three minutes now and interesting I was I'm surprised that this guy is holding up hmm. so we are uh, finishing up couple seconds left and MacBook Pro just completed the task of editing the movie that was uh, two and a half minutes two minutes and 40 seconds and uh, MacBook Air has another two minutes to go so really guys if it was me I mean like this is my computer this is my friend's computer if it was me when you're really on the budget and you really have money to spend and kinda you know wanna get your money I would say go with MacBook Air um, i7 quad uh, dual core processor and max it to 8 gigs of RAM just like this guy is 256 gig, uh, gigabyte hard drive solid state drive um, and you really um, not sitting that bad with this machine because you're you're you know you're saving hundreds of dollars $2200 machine versus uh, fourteen hundred dollar, fourteen fifty, I believe, if you put it together at this specs, it's it's pretty good. It's it's doing really good. So next video, I'm gonna make of. Well, you can watch my other videos. I'm comparing multiple different machines and older MacBook Pros versus these guys. And um, I got a couple MacBook Airs. And next video, I'm gonna make off of this MacBook Air i7 versus MacBook Air the same model of i5 processor so it's going to be i7 versus i5 two MacBook Airs uh, it's going to be interesting and it's about wrapping up it's got a couple seconds to go and I'll say so two and a half minutes versus four minutes not bad of a deal two minutes apart but again, this is a short video, so I'll say it's 20% slower, 30, 30% slower, um, and it's done. Almost. Here you go. Well, here you go. You got it.